Good morning, everyone. My name is Zia, and I make videos about full-time life in my shuttle bus. It is, I don't know, about 6.30 in the morning. I've just been into Tim Hortons here to get myself a coffee and a bran muffin because I'm hitting the road this morning to head to Summerland for the uh, Boulder Women Camping Weekend that um, I'm holding along with my girlfriend in her cherry orchard. Today I'm going to probably only drive, It's I think it's only about a five hour drive, six hour drive, I'm not sure. But I'm gonna just take my time and I'm going to stop in about two and a half hours in a place called Manning Park, and I'm probably going to stay the night in Manning Park. I'm really excited about um, the event next weekend, and um, I've been busy prepping all week. Let's see if we can do better with the light here. Oh, it's a bit bright. So I'm ready to go, and um, let's hit the road. I've stopped at the um, visitor's center in the park and I'm just going to have a bite to eat and I'm trying to decide whether I want to stay the night in one of the campsites or whether I want to or whether I want to just carry on and um, find somewhere to stealth camp. I'm thinking about biting the bullet and getting a campsite, which isn't usually in within my budget, because I want to be able to have the lights and things on because I have some things I need to do still um, before I get to Summerland. So, yeah, I think I'll just sit and have a sandwich, something to drink, and then decide what I'm going to do. Well, in the end, I didn't get to stay in a campsite because you needed to have cash for when the rangers came around. And I didn't have any cash on me, so I just carried on all the way to Summerland. But it was a beautiful day and a beautiful drive. about five miles from my friend Anne's orchard where we're having our event. But look at what I'm driving beside. How beautiful is this? Very different on the other side of the road. Very dry, barren landscape. And then this. There are still quite a lot of cherries on the trees in the orchard. And if I zoom in up this avenue of trees, those are branches that have been broken off by a bear trying to reach some of the cherries and she loses branches every year. I haven't seen any bears out here, but we are finding they must be coming by I don't know, early morning or late night. 
because there are a few branches we find each day. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Everyone's arriving tomorrow. Today is Thursday. We are going crazy with prep for the Boulder Women's Weekend. And I'm so excited. We had been working so hard all week that today we decided to treat ourselves and go to one of the local wineries with four of Anne's friends and it was called Dirty Laundry. Really lovely place, really kind of quirky and interesting. We had the best pizza, the best pizzas, and um, rosé slushies. So it was a really nice break. Uh, we laughed quite a bit and then came back to the orchard and carried on with our prep. It's now Thursday evening and most of the prep is done. We have a few things, last minute things to do in the morning. Uh, I received uh, a message today from our Boulder woman that's driven here all the way from Quebec, all the way from Quebec, coming to this event tomorrow. And she's really excited and several others have messaged to say they're really looking forward to it. So it's been a busy week and it's going to be a really busy weekend. I think we're going to have a lot of fun. I'm a little bit anxious. I haven't, um, I haven't facilitated this workshop for a while now, but I'm hoping this is the start of bringing me out of rewirement, not retirement, rewirement, and also um, the start of building some community with some of the senior solo women in Canada. And um, I'm gonna try and film some of the weekend if the women attending are okay with that. I really hope to have some footage to show you. Hopefully I will sleep tonight, but I'm not counting on it. And I will see you all again soon. Wherever you are in our great big world, I hope you're having a wonderful day. And I'm going to say bye-bye for now. I love you all, and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.